welcome to another video from Agni. Uh, this video today is going to be a little bit different. This is going to actually be discussing a future update um, with some of the little teasers that the Ants official has given us and things that uh, players have found. And um, actually, this is going to be a shout out to one of my friends who also does some YouTubing, um, who actually provided me with um, the video that we'll be sharing today. But before we get into all that, got to go into the usual shenanigans that we do. Uh, this video is sponsored by Aptoys. Uh, there will be a link down in the description below about how you can get access to Aptoids and be able to start making, uh, saving money on any and all in-game purchases that you play, that you make in the game, from anywhere from 5 to 40% off. Uh, they also do giveaways that are about monthly to where it's even an additional percent off and there's times you can get up even at, uh, into the 60 to 70 percent off so take full advantage of it it works great i use it every day um, a lot of my people in the discord and that are subscribed use it um, so make full use of it today now uh going on with that as we start to get to the point that we will be able to start getting monetary gain uh, from not only the, this sponsor, but eventually from YouTube itself, what I will be doing is I will be, for the first three months, I'll be giving 100% away to whoever subscribed and in my Discord. After that, I'll be giving 25% uh, away on a monthly basis. So invite your friends, jump in the Discord, which there will be a link down below with that. Um, this Discord is used as a community tool. There's lots of people in there that, that really know what they're talking about, that can help you out with any questions. So in there, there's absolutely no bashing, bullying, being mean, anything like that, or else you'd be banned immediately. But with that, we'll go right into the actual meat and potatoes of this. So recently, um, the Ants released a teaser showing two uh, special ants that would be evolved, uh, essentially. And they, they had shown the graphics of these two ants. Um, so a lot of us at first had thought that there was only going to be these two ants that are getting, it might have been three, I forget, that were getting a upgrade. Um, but that's not the case at all. And it's actually something that you can see in the game right now, uh, which do you, uh, God, I'm going to butcher this do yes uh is the one that actually showed me and made the uh, the video to where you can actually see it in game but if you slow down if you're recording you slow down your frame rate to it's literally one frame that you can see what these ants are going to be mutated to as far as what they're they will visually look like so we'll show you that um also go into kind of my speculation as to why they're doing this what effect it might have um, again, speculation, I don't know for sure, um, but we'll go ahead and jump right into that. All right, so let's jump right into it. So this is, again, this is not my video, this is somebody else's video, but this is going to go through and show you um, the different changes that you can see from slowing down your ants to um, one frame rate. And it's literally just a frame that you can see these. Uh, and I'll show you some stills of it as well. There's Giant Tooth, the Golden Venom was already shown. Now we don't, we can't gleam of anything about what their actual skills or stats will be and what has actually changed. Um, but I'll go into some speculation with that. But this is all active in game. You can do it yourself if you wish. Um, but we'll go through so you can kind of see the, each of the visual representation and real time that will show the uh, stills and we'll get back over into the game and I'll just kind of go through my speculation of this. And there's Spanish Panda. Which each of these visual representations look really cool, honestly. I'm, I'm, I'm sure it'll cost something that'll be like the underground um, maze that you know you're gonna have to probably do something and get a certain amount of materials to eventually be able to unlock the 
um, evolved uh, versions of them it would be my speculation um, but of course you know we'll have to see another about 30 to 45 seconds there's guard general And let's see, there's Dark Hercules. Dark Hercules one was really cool looking. Yeah, the one thing that's kind of different though is there's actually like, it, it's taken away from, because all these ants are actually ants that are in real life, so it's kind of taken away from that a little bit as far as um, real life representation. That part I could see where a lot of people are not going to be too much fans of, but depending on how the upgrade is, it might be very good. But anyway, we'll go into the stills that I have there's New World General there's Golden Armor and Giant Tooth Jack Jumper Acid General it almost turns into looking in almost like Beetles uh, Guard General and Golden Venom and Banshee Panda and Dark Hercules. So anyway, so now we'll jump back over into the game and I'll go into my speculation of all this. So what I think and the reason why they're doing this is because it, it's become such monotony as far as the combat in the combat system and what you see in um, Groundhog and um, fighting, PvP, PvE, Penguin, whatever, that you always basically see the exact same lineups and honestly um, these days a lot of it is just mostly pay to win ants now that you see so what I kind of see them doing or the reason why they're doing this they kind of see it as a uh, they're trying to do a, a balancing to be able to make the rest of the ants more viable again to be able to actually have some use to them which is great actually it's, it's a good um, if, if I'm correct it's a good way for them to kind of move forward because it would be nice to start seeing some different lineups instead of, you know, the generic basic things that you always see in pretty much every person's lineup. It's always the same three ants that do the best. You know, it's, it's always the same exact um, lineup, et cetera, et cetera. So it really helps to break away from the monotony of it. Um, I also expect that there'll be some pay to win aspect of it, which there always is to be able to possibly get these faster or whatnot. Um, I am interested to see if it, how much it actually improves the stats and it, it kind of, what would be really nice is if the um, enhanced or evolved um, version of these ants actually would give some different skills. Um, I think would be really good instead of some of these ants base skills that they have. Um, some of them obviously I imagine that they will keep normal, but um, you can kind of see them moving in that direction with like Jack Jumper's Awakening to where it's a good possibility that they might actually be fundamentally changing um, the skills of the ants. Again, speculation, I don't know, um, but that would be really interesting and it would be definitely interesting to start seeing, you know, some of these ants that nobody uses like Guard General, um, Acid General, things like that actually become useful because uh, they haven't been since the very beginning of the game so it would be interesting i think it's a like i said i think it's a good move um uh, for the ants to start doing that um and i think it'll bring a lot more attention back to the game um if i'm correct in my speculation now if it's like if it's something that's like basically getting a skin for your ant i think that that would be really stupid that'd be a really terrible idea um, but we have seen them go crazy with the cosmetics in the past, so that even might be a possibility. But we'll see. At any rate, uh, it wasn't really an informative video per se, but uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like, subscribe, join the Discord. Uh, be ready for some giveaways that will happen soon and some more 
exciting information that I'll be sharing. Egg Maze out.